Welcome my dear students to week 18. In week 18, we will start talking about the second type of the genetic information that can be found in your human body, which is RNA. As we said before, RNA is a type of the genetic information found in, uh, during the process of protein synthesis, where the double strand, double helix strands of DNA will be divided and a complementary strand will be uh, reaffirmed again. Now, one of the strands, the complementary strand, will be only one strand, which is called the RNA. Now, why is it called RNA? RNA for ribose and nucleic acid. As we said in the DNA, DNA, the ribose sugar, which is the five carbon sugars, missing one of the oxygen in it. So it, ha it has one oxygen removed. That's why it's called deoxyribonucleic acid. Mean removing one oxygen from the, carb uh, from the carbons that's found in the ribose sugar. On the other hand, Ribose, uh, ribonucleic acid RNA has uh, has the five the five carbons contains the five uh, oxygen with no uh, no missing oxygen. So today we will talk about the RNA with the no missing oxygen uh, with inside the, the uh, sugar. Now, during this lesson, we will describe how RNA differs from DNA, that how it, they are different from each other, and explain how the cell makes RNA in the three forms of the RNA. Comparing DNA to RNA, as I said before, we have the double strands or double helix strands for the DNA, while the RNA is only a linear one. Either uh, no, uh, also the nucleic acids, nucleic acids, which is the nitrogen bases inside it, contain guanine, cytosine, adenine in both of them, where thymine found only in DNA and uracil found only in the RNA. So uh, within the, uh, the RNA, the thymine is replaced by uracil. So uh, and the uh, third thing that DNA is uh, deoxyribose has means that missing one oxygen. On the other hand, the RNA has the complete uh, the complete oxygen. So the sugar in the RNA is ribose instead of deoxyribose. RNA is generally signal strands, not double strands, and RNA contain neural cell in a, in a place of the thymine. There is three types of RNA: messenger RNA, ribosomal RNA, and transfer RNA. During our lessons, we will talk about each one of them, starting with messenger RNA, how it's a copy of the protein of the DNA will be used to make the protein, which is our main goal. And then after being made in the nucleus, messenger RNA will travel into the cytoplasm, the site of the protein where the protein will be synthesized. Then the ribosomal RNA that's, that's related to the uh, ribosomes uh, that's made up the two sub units for the RNA. These subunits consist of several molecules of ribosomal RNA, and it contains um, about 80 different proteins. Second part is transfer RNA, which is during protein synthesis, transfer RNA molecules carried amino acid from cytoplasm to messenger RNA. Then we will go through the uh, process of uh, transcription. And the RNA synthesis, where we have the two uh, type, the parts of the RNA synthesis and editing for the RNA, the introns and extrons, and how do they uh, remove the introns and exons to make one a new one uh, containing only 